the Mr. Excel Podcast is sponsored by Easy Excel. Learn Excel from Mr. Excel Podcast, episode 1489, rename 31 worksheets. All right, well, hey, if you were here yesterday, you saw that podcast where Damien asked how to create uh, 30 copies of a worksheet, and I showed a great way using control drag, but now uh, the, the worksheet names all have to be renamed. And yes, we could go through and do this and still you know, be faster than what Damien was doing before, but there has to be a better way. I know a lot of you don't like VBA, but this one is just so flat out simple. Alt F11 to get to VBA, Control G as in girl to get to the immediate window. Then we say for I equals 1 to 31 colon, that's next line, and we're going to say worksheets I dot name is equal to. Now what do we want it to be? In this case, I have day, space, and then the number. So day, space, close quotes, ampersand, and an I. And then another colon to go to the next line, next. All right, so right there, that tiny little bit of code, I'm going to press enter. All right, that's all it took. It's fixed now. Now, if you happen to be in February or April or a day that doesn't have 31, then right at the very end, that's going to provide an error. So I'm going to do 32 worksheets here. Runtime error 9, subscript out of range. That's OK. By the time you get to the error, it's fixed. In February, you might have to click OK uh, a couple of times because it's trying to rename sheets that aren't there. Now let's go back to um, Excel. That's Alt Q to return back to Excel. Oh, check that out. All of the days all the way are automatically numbered just like that. All right. So. Uh, what a bizarre little piece of code if you don't know VBA. Alt F11, Control G, uh, type this. You know, and if you didn't want uh, day, if you just wanted the the um, the day number like one through thirty-one, uh, instead of putting day in there, just put that. All right, and that would. Well, here, let's let's just run it, and I'll change this back to thirty-one. Um, press Enter. That ran that bit of code. Now it's just numbered one through thirty-one. What a fabulous way to go through and re number all of those sheets uh, and you'll see that they uh, they just yep, go in perfect order straight across. So cool trick part two to solve uh, Damia's problem. Okay, well hey I want to thank everyone for stopping by. We'll see you next time for another netcast. Mr. Excel.